Hello everyone, Microsoft 2024 just dropped recently and native Tubi support is a bit strange at the moment since you need to use OpenTrack. So right now I'm going to run you through this like right fast and we can save other YouTube pleasantries for the end. All right, so the first thing you want to do is make sure you put it right here on UDP over network and then next uh, free point free track 2.0 and Yes, I'm assuming that you have Toby Game Hub installed and OpenTrack. I will link to those in the description, and I will also link to this URL in the description. So check that. So after you have all those selected, and I did not change that, that's default right there. I go here to options. You want to go here maybe, and you go here, and you want to make sure this is checked, invert X. And this is something I did. I disabled Z, but by default, you're going to look like this. But for me, I always disable that because I hate moving my head back and it's just, you know, I'm outside the cockpit. All right. So that's pretty much it for that. I'm going to click OK. That way you save that. And then here, mapping, I love that default. You might want to adjust your curves or fine tune things. I didn't. I just left it default. Seemed fine for me. And then next here, and oh, I already have it here, but... Okay, this is where you're going to be here. When you first open up Game Hub, Toby Game Hub, you're going to be there. You click Games, and then if you don't see Open Track, Open Track should appear like it's always first for me. If it's not there, update your Toby Game Hub to the latest. Update it to the latest. And then it should appear for you, hopefully. If not, I'm not sure you might want to hop on the Toby Discord. All right. So, and that's it. I didn't change. I don't recall changing any. I didn't change anything in here, but you can. You can, like, bind the key so you can disable it. But so far, I've been using my keyboard, but you might want to bind this to a key, actually, now to think of it. Well, I mean, like, for me, I'm going to bind it to my whole toss. Now that I'm thinking about it. And that's pretty much it, I'm thinking, right? That's all, like, once you get ready to play the game, I notice that you need to have both of these guys running, actually. You need to have the Toby Game Hub. You need to have, uh, make sure you're, you've already clicked on that guy and you're like running that is connected and it's, it shows it's running and everything. And then you click the start button and then, yeah, you can just hop in there. Like right now, I don't have my Toby even activated, but yeah, it want, you're going to see movement once you move your eyes around. Your Toby should be tracking your eye movement and all that kind of stuff. All right, that's pretty much it. So yeah, if you find this video helpful, go ahead and hit that like. And then my next video, I uh, should be covering my thoughts on Microsoft 2024 VR. All right, that's it. Thanks for watching. Goodbye.